Uh, well, I cooked a beautiful bird for Friendsgiving. Let's check it out. Ooh. Ah. <laughs> oh, shit. Hey, did you drop that? Good evening, and welcome to another episode of The Grilled Cheese Show. I'm Corey. I'm Cameron. And tonight we have a very special Friendsgiving episode for you. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Did you really drop the turkey? Well, tonight we've got a fun-filled, action-packed episode for you. We've got a performance from Mike Brown. We're joined by our friends Kit Monroe and The Widow. And we have a performance from Sex Brews. So stick around. You're not going to want to miss that. Anyway, Cameron, I heard you had your own Friendsgiving this year. Yeah. Well, let's uh, check it out, see how it went. Is it positive? What does this mean? Are you canceling Friendsgiving? Are you canceling Friendsgiving? Tell me! Tell me, Ari! Tell me, are we canceling Friendsgiving? Gobble, 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 Hey, it's me, Cameron, and I'm doing the music reviews. But first, the weekly shout outs. This week's songs are Welcome Waves, Streets of Gold, Young Lion Song, Monte Cristo, Malik the God with 2 AM, and Planetary People's Song, Stank. Okay, now the reviews. This artist is the main dish, the turkey, the turkey and the gravy, the tasty taste, Cosmo Pike. I haven't done him yet. Yes! And his song is a piper 
for Janet. And it's just the best of UK rock pop. Just go listen to it. It's good. All right, next is M. Rose with The Grass Was Greener. And if you don't know this, I'm a sucker for some good rock and pop. And this goes from all the vibes to really exploding. Like hot grease. I just added that. For real, maybe one of my new favorite artists. Listening to M. Rose makes me feel gravy. Wait, I meant groovy. Okay, no more Thanksgiving puns. Anyway, you can go listen to most of these artists on our almost 24-7 live YouTube radio. And don't forget, like and subscribe to our YouTube. Did I do that one already? Skip it. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our YouTube. Wow, great review, Cameron. Thanks. You know, I'm thankful we got this episode done in time. Well, I'm sure thankful for Mike Brown coming up right now. Yeah. Man, it's an honor to be on the Grilled Cheese Show. Uh huh. Listen, hey, I'm Mike. Tell me what's your name. I know that this is strange, but did we meet the other day? I ain't got no play, I guess that you can call me lame But I know that you don't mind, I saw you staring at the game I saw you ask your girls my name and they say Girl, that's a shame, cause you know you got a man But you just own them out Hey, you nigga, he just zones you out So now y'all two unconscious souls together Only book control, man, I know it's getting old It's time for new chatter, matter of fact, throw the whole book away It's just pages with no words It's like faith without the works Like a song without a verse So a preacher with no word Ain't no point in really loving if your love is only Yeah, come on Cinderella, live a little I know it's 12 o'clock and that you drove your mother's rental You know how we go, the model was YOLO Let's ditch our friends, girl, tonight we riding solo Baby, let's go loco, let's go to Hope Polo We can watch a movie Sipping on hot cocoa We can laugh or cry Then cuddle in the bed I wish I were awake Cause that was all in my head Yeah Sometimes I fantasize When I close my eyes Just thinking about my sweet cherry pie I can't even lie I stay up at night Just thinking about you Sweet cherry pie Wait, stop, hold up, it's a quarter past twelve Gotta go to work to get my dorm I walked in LA, my boss said, what about time to show up? I said, man, I was dreaming about my angel He said, you're going too far You better be glad that I shit working hard Now go clock in and take those orders at the bar Can I help you girls at all? You turn around and then I saw It was you yeah, Mike, what you doing? Are you dreaming on the job? Didn't I just tell you take those orders at the bar? Listen, man, I'm sorry, but this girl, she got my heart. Boy, if you don't get smart, you gon' be looking for a job. Mike, is that her? Sitting at the bar. Why you acting scared? Go over there and talk. Tell me what to say. Boy, just speak your heart. Excuse me, can I tell you how I feel? Sometimes I fantasize when I close my eyes. Just thinking about my sweet cherry pie. I can't even lie. I stay up at night. Just thinking about my sweet cherry. Sometimes I fantasize when I close my eyes. Just thinking about my sweet cherry pie. I can't even lie. I stay up at night. Just thinking about my Yeah, cherry pie. Oh, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh. Da da da.
Uh, thanks, Mike Brown, for stopping by. And now, a word from our sponsor. You should be driving a Honda. You should be driving a Honda. From some Honda. From some Honda. Hit All right, All right folks, you asked for it, you got it. Uh, you come on down to Stokes Honda. Uh, we've got some, some slashing deals going on. We've got Honda Civics. We've got Honda Elements. Uh, we've got Honda Accords. Um, we've got all the Hondas you could ask for. So just come on down, 0% uh, financing uh, and all that stuff. So come on down to Stokes Honda, guys. Come on, let's do it. Kick it back in, John. That, that's, that's, the, that's the ad. Come on, let's kick it back in. All right, here we go. You should, you should be, be driving a Honda. Honda. You should be driving a Honda. From Stokes Honda. From Stokes Honda. Honda. Good evening, and welcome to another segment of Movies with Corey. This is the part of the show where I talk to you about a movie that you could watch. But tonight's theme is Thanksgiving, and there aren't a whole lot of Thanksgiving movies. So I'm just going to talk about movies that come out around the holidays in general, and what we can do to make the holiday movie viewing experience more enjoyable. So when we talk about Thanksgiving movies, I can really only think of two. One is the great John Hughes film, Planes, Trains, and Automobiles, which happens to be the first R-rated movie I ever saw. Great movie, by the way. Check it out. John Candy and Steve Martin in a classic comedy pairing. The other Thanksgiving movie that I can think of I didn't watch, uh, but it stars Robert Downey Jr. and Holly Hunter in a film by Jodie Foster called Home for the Holidays. And I have no interest in watching this one and I can't give you a recommendation on whether or not to watch it. But what I will talk about is Christmas movies. When Thanksgiving comes around, everybody starts watching Christmas movies. Not everybody likes Christmas. Some people just want a holiday movie that's not Christmas themed. You've got movies like Groundhog Day, which takes place in February. It's like a Christmas movie, but it doesn't take place at Christmas, but there are no real movies that take place at Thanksgiving. I can think of the Thanksgiving song from Adam's Family Values, which is classic, but that's actually a summer camp movie. So what are we going to do about Thanksgiving movies? I actually don't have a solution. I just wish Hollywood was a little bit more creative. And that's all I have to say about the subject tonight. Short and sweet. Back to the show. Whoa! Super review, Corey! Oh, thanks, Cameron. Well, coming up next, we have our brand new segment, The Fur Between, featuring Kit Monroe 
and the widow. Well, welcome what? to the grilled cheese the kids show. show. But the fur between. This is the fur between. And we we have Kit Monroe here. Hello. Hello. Hello, hello, hello. Hello. So lovely to be here. I, I don't know, I'm copying your accent. Oh, you're, you're really doing from a very good Where job. are you from in London, the UK? Oh, you know. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Um well, uh you you have a show coming up. You want to I talk do. about that? I do. I have quick? a little show. A little show. It's called the Freak Show Two. It's the second volume of the Freak Show. We had one last year. It was a wonderful time. Tell us um, about the, the a cool little debauchery. Well, it was um, a lot of fun. Oh, so basically, it's going to be on December twelfth, and I kind of just was feeling like, in general, that this year everyone's kind of had a pretty rough year, mm -hmm. and I really was going to give everyone an opportunity to kind of just be themselves and let loose and not have to worry about a damn thing, just enjoying themselves. Other than wearing the mask, which is on. Right, you have to wear a mask. Required. You have to definitely follow all of the guidelines that have been set in place by the CDC. It is on Eventbrite if you have any questions about what the actual guidelines are. But you will have temperature checks at the gates. That's one thing that's going to happen. and. Um, so don't come up there sick because we're not going to let you in. Simple. And I do agree <laughs> with that this might be the last moment before shows are... Shut down for a while. Yeah, I mean, it's, yeah, it's going to be shut and down I, for a while. And I went back and forth about it because, you know, I've seen it's different cities shutting down. And I'm like, okay, what are we doing? I was like, no, we're, we're doing this. It's on 12-12. We manifested this. And, like, we're doing this. Doing it. Yeah. What, um... What kind of fun things can you do at the show? So there is going to be yeah. <laughs> that a lot of pretty beautiful humans that I have been so blessed to have in my life that are incredibly talented. Um, we have people that are um, musicians, um, burlesque dancers, lyra artists, um, pole dancers. Uh, what else? We have fire performers. Um, we're gonna have a human ginger had gingerbread house display. There's gonna be a human pet play area that's sanitized between each person. We have Ashley Thompson that's going to be Mistress Kinky Claws, and she's gonna have a naughty list and let okay. people know if they're on it or not. <laughs> So, everyone, everyone there. Yeah, everyone's on it. You, you're getting everyone. No getting one, cold. no one's on the nice it's list 2020. this year. Yeah, we all need to be naughty mm -hmm. for a night. Mm -hmm. So, what <laughs> ways do you stay healthy? Where Just kidding. Go? Who is that? This is one of my bestest friends in the world. Um, this she she goes by the Hi. she goes by the widow. That's not what I call her, but it's T H E E widow. Do you want to say it? Widow. Okay. Well, you started, so I was going to let you finish. Yes. <laughs> yes, you on did. all social medias, probably. Most, yes, most she's, social so medias. she's on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook. Um, you can find her on OnlyFans. Um, all so. right, well, Kit, what is <laughs> your, what are you thankful for? Oh, um, but I have social media, too. Well, say it. Okay, so mine is The Burnless Flame, and my uh, production company is Burnless Flame Productions. And I know that's super long and annoying, but... Type it in, whatever. It's, it's, it's just whatever. So, Burnless Flame Productions, and then Kit Monroe is for my Facebook. And you can find me on OnlyFans under Kit underscore Monroe. And your last question, I'm sorry. What's your favorite primary color? Oh, gosh, that's really hard to say. It depends on my mood. Mm. Can I go over the, like, why? Tell me. Well, yeah, let's wrap yeah, it up. Yeah, so basically, long story short, it's like blue is just really calming, but red is very passionate. That's yeah. why I had purple hair for three years. That explains that. Yeah. I feel like that's... <laughs> 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 All right, well, that's the, sh the interview. <laughs> yeah. Swipe. Yeah, thank you for watching the kid show, for real. <laughs> That's it. That's what she's thankful yeah, for. Yeah, I mean, Bye. thanks for letting me take over for the day. No problem. <laughs> oh, tell me you're canceling Friendsgiving. I know! 
Oh no! Ours cancel your friends giving! <laughs> Black one! Ever, man! Oh, I <laughs> don't cancel Friends Giving! I need this! <laughs> next year. Yeah, if we don't die. Okay. Alright. Bye. Pizza time. Pizza time. Pizza time. Pizza time. Now. Time. For. Sex brews. One. Two. Three. I wanna dip your in a man and stick it to the right, 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 right. Dip your in a man and stick it to the right, right, right. I wanna dip your in a man and stick it to the right, right, right. Dip your in a man and stick it to the right, right. Fresh to a pan again, scribble on my right leg. Do a line of cool leg. Take you to the right leg. Grind up on the suit of bed and put it on my pancake. Jalapeno cool leg. Ballerina escalate. Dancing on a live wire. Take me to the palisades. Met a girl on my space. In the early 90s. Bite it like a boomerang. Face like a flower. I want to dip your hand in babies. Take it to the right. Grind up on a suit of fat and put it on my pancakes. Take your ass to Vegas, dress you up as Elvis. Hit up all the buffets, cover you with band aids. We'll cover you with band aids. You know, ladies and gentlemen out there on the internet. We're not used to playing in places like this With less than 700 or a thousand screaming people Or 10,000 probably It's probably how many people we're used to playing for But what a lot of you guys don't know about sex brew What you don't know is Is that we grew up right down the road Right down the road on an old dirt road in the woods with our grandpappies. Grandpappies. All four grandpappies and all, all four of us in one house. And our grandpappy used to send us off to the store and this is what he would say to us. Said, if you going to the ride, pick me up some razor blades. Seven cans of Vaseline, two boxes of Band-Aids. I don't be no better it, put a better it. Oh, something, 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 something I wanna read. light up all these cigarettes Smoke them like a chia bag Go out in the rain and be like Hey, you do not get me wet I'll pick you like a muffin Until you're brown and golden Grind up all the suit of fat And put it inside the stuff And dip your hand in bands Stick it to the right Grind up all the suit of fat And put it on my pancakes Take your ass to Vegas Dress you up as Elvis Hit up all the buffets Cover you with band-aids Strawberry mandate 
tornado buffet, buffet y'all. These shoes feel great. I said I wanna dip you in mayonnaise, take you to the right aid. Well, I wanna dip you in mayonnaise, take you to the right aid. Take it to the right aid, right aid, right aid. I wanna dip you in the maze. Take it to the right aid, right aid. I wanna dip you in the maze. Take it to the right aid. Grind up all the suit of and put it on my pants. Take your ass to Vegas, dress you up as Elvis. Hit up all the buffets, cover you with them. That's the show. Thanks, Mike Brown. Thanks, Kit Monroe and the Widow. And thank you, Sex Brews. Who don't like it? Look and subscribe to our YouTube. All right. We'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.